Since coming on board as the head coach for the Harambe Stars, Paul Putt has hardly put a foot wrong. In his first regional assignment, the Sakafa Senior Challenge Cup, Kenya was crowned champions, lifting the trophy for the first time since 2013 and going through the entire campaign unbeaten, conceding only twice in the final. It is clear that the program he spoke of implementing during his appointment as Harambe Stars coach has begun. I think uh, you have been seeing results. I think you have been seeing the progress of the team. I think uh, there's a lot to do uh, in the structure, in the organization uh, to move forward. So uh, give me the time, please. Uh, like I said, uh, I will work on it. I have now the time to work on it. Known for flying in a technical coaching staff from Belgium for key matches, the coach is yet to decide whether he will embark on the same with Kenya. He, however, emphasized the importance of the support of the government in his quest to revitalize Harambe stars. Everything is possible. I don't say yes, I don't say no. Uh, these are discussions I have to make. And also uh, I have to see uh, what is the ambitions of the Kenyan government uh, because um, everything uh, has its price. And uh, if you will go further, if you will go and reach the top, it's also investments. But I think now we have been proving there is something. So I hope now everybody will support uh, the national team. And we have to do everything possible to reach our uh, target. Having had the chance to see the local players in action, he will have a tough task ahead to determine which of the foreign-based players will form part of his 2019 African Cup of Nation qualifier squad. For put, every player will start on an equal footing. First of all, you have to give me the time to know the foreign players because I didn't see him play. So uh, I told uh, everyone will start at the same level. And we're going to build on a team who is capable uh, to play Afghan and uh, in the future to put Kenyan uh, with the biggest and the strongest team uh, of Africa. Coming off the Sakafa success and in spite of Kenya suffering a 2-1 loss to Sierra Leone in their first match, Put maintains his confidence in Kenya's chances of qualifying for the continental showpiece in Cameroon. With this tournament we have been doing after one week, uh, getting the boys or working with them to, to uh, win the Sekafa, I think it gives hope. It gives hope to the Kenyan people, it gives hope uh, to the Kenyan football, it gives hope uh, to everyone, so we're going to continue on this uh, road. Paul Putt's next major test is a stern Afghan qualifying meeting against four times champions Ghana in 2018. Mukami Wambora for Citizen TV.